Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexon and welcome back everybody to the Crafting Dead. This is Somerset number one server um, and I'm so excited to be back on here again after last time we were with Brazilla, uh, Matrix, Donnie and it was just a blast. We did a lot of cool things especially with the challenge of the loot crate. You guys all enjoyed it so thank you guys so much for all the support you guys have been leaving on the Crafting Dead in general and on the channel so high five to you guys. Before this video starts let's go see how much you guys can support this uh, video by hitting that like button. And let's see how far we can take it other than that guys in today's episode we're gonna go on a solo run we're gonna see how far we can take this journey and hopefully we don't die before that I want to actually go and shop and I want to make our own little uh, you know design for our clothing for today's episode I'm gonna try to maybe try something different and challenge myself to do a different design uh, every episode if not maybe we're gonna stick with one design so let me know what you guys think about today's design and uh, in the comment sections and then from there we'll move on maybe it'll be good maybe not so what I want to go with is for now because it has the best protection is either the police suit or um, maybe a fireman's clothing or I think it's it's between the fireman's clothing or the police suit and in general I think we can rock with the uh, maybe the police suit we'll go with the police suit all right um, and now when it comes to guns you guys all know the FNFAL is the gun we're gonna be using for a while now I also want to get a trench gun because it is really cool um, and I'm gonna get some ammo for all of this hopefully to have trench gun ammo I'm not really sure but for sure we're gonna take a lot of FNFAL ammo uh, I'm not oh there it is trench gun okay we're gonna take two of those um, just to be safe and I think other than that we're fine uh, for weapons I always like to go with my fireman's axe because it is a really cool weapon also a sledgehammer is nice so usually I go for two um, and that way we're good from there for hats we have a lot of cool hats to choose from now there's a lot of helmets we can go for but thinking that I already have that pollu uh, police suit is like a blue color maybe it would be kind of cool to go with a um, I think a black helmet maybe a right actually Spetnaz helmet we'll go with that that looks kind of cool I think we'll see how that works out for us we could have gone with the sheriff's hat but it kind of looks weird we'll try it out anyways um and then what else do we need oh of course backpack so we need a gray tactical vest so i think either gray yeah gray would, or yeah gray would be best let's go for a large uh yeah let's go for a large backpack gray one uh, other than that some food of course we're gonna take oh they don't have mre so we're gonna take some open tactical bacon um some open canned beans and that should be Fair enough. We're probably going to find a lot of supplies. We're kind of looting up a lot. Drinkables is simple. We just need a lot of water like that. Um, med packs here. Just some bandages. Um, maybe a makeshift splint. And other than that, maybe one med pack. And other than that, I think we're all set here. Uh, we have our weapons. We have our ammo. Uh, we have everything else. We have building blocks. These are actually really expensive. Uh, so we're not going to work with that because, of course, we are with uh, the Bearzilla group. So let's get this gear on because we've been uh, looking around. So this doesn't look half bad. Of course, we could go with the um, Spetnaz helmet, but that doesn't look too good. Maybe we might have to go with the... Oh, there we go. You know what? We're going to go with the Sheriff's hat, guys. So I'm going to throw out the Spetnaz helmet. We're going to pop this stuff on here. And I think that looks pretty cool in general. I like it. doesn't look half bad at all. Uh, let's actually reload this gun right here. Bam, the FNFL. I love it, guys. I love it. And the trench gun is absolutely intense as well. So... Wait, I gotta forget, I, I forget sometimes. So I believe it's to zoom, it's with the right. There we go. Because I'm used to decimation as well. Other than that, let's store some goods in here. So two water bottles. Let's store one bandage and one of each food. Um, and then we'll put in, I think, two, uh, three clips of FNFAL ammo in there. And I believe we have one more trench gun ammo. So we're not looking half bad here. We got our food. We got our... And I think we're going to take the uh, sledgehammer as our uh, main melee weapon. Other than that, our medical gear will go straight down in the middle here. Food on this side and other gear and weapons on that side. So we're all organized and good to go. Actually, I want to take a bandage and a makeshift splint and a food and a water in my inventory just in case things go south store my trench gun and let's get going guys look at this this does not look half bad at all guys i gotta be honest looks pretty good pretty good so let's go slash our spawn let's get this party started guys it's been a while i know i know that it's been four minutes of solid uh building of this camp but we spawned in a great area so I'm looking forward to see what we can find around here. Hopefully, we can find some supplies. Also, down below in the comment sections, make sure to let me know what you guys think about this design. But, uh, oh, I thought I saw someone there. These guys, these guys trick me sometimes. Some of the walkers look like people sometimes, depending on their disguises. But, 
Other than that, I think it's pretty cool. I think we have a pretty big... Oh, this is a dock. Oh, this is gonna be infested with people. Let me, I think I can use slash near. Uh, so we have one person. Oh, this dude. Hey. Okay, this guy. I'm gonna. I'm gonna watch out, dude. Watch out, man. All right. So this guy's another fox. Hey, it's another fox. Actually, I just thought about that. We should give him a. We should give him some weapons, right, guys? I think it's fair enough to. Here, take this. Take this. Uh, we're gonna give him. Uh, let's give him a kit slash kit. Uh, slash kit. I think it'd be safe to go with assault. I think that's. Fair, if anything. So let's throw him down the assault kit. Bam, bada bing, bada boom. Um, I think that's a lot of the stuff that comes with the assault kit. There we go. Um, what else? Army clothing. We're gonna maybe swap out army clothing. Guys, do you think it's fair to swap out with army clothing? Because I think that'd be a bit better than uh, the military or the police. Yeah, we're gonna go with the uh, swap that out. Throw keep the frag grenade actually. Give him an MRE. Um, other than that, I think we are okay with other supplies uh you can have that perfect you guys you can have all that have it all okay there we go so we got someone um just in case another fox here so that's pretty cool oh and let me drop him that as well and other than that we're good we're good are right, you good man i think he's just packing up on some supplies we're just gonna keep looking around while he does that we're not gonna go too far and stretch out but as i uh, as of right now all i can say is slash near it was only him for the most part. But we're going to clear out this building. Um, I'll be in the building. There we go. Just in case he doesn't know where I am. We're just going to break. Oh, gosh. There's a lot of zombies in here, guys. Okay. Well, we can do it. We can do it. We can take out these walkers. Uh, do we have that frag grenade? Yes, we do. Okay, perfect. Check this out, guys. Bam. Yes. There we go. Finally. It works. Okay, sweet. Um, let's see. Is that guy still there? What's his name? The block? Oh, yes. A crate. Uh, what do we get here? Oh, juggernaut suit. That's actually really good. So we're gonna store that in there. Bam. Is this guy still... So oh, did I see him walking around here? There he is, right here. Hey, buddy. Yo, 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 yo. Turn around. It's me. <laughs> All right, I think he's, he's walking around. We're getting a bit of lag. Actually, let me do something while I'm at that. There we go. Much better. Uh, all right, let's keep looking around here and see if we can find some more supplies. I gave him some fair, a fair share of my gear for the assault kit, so I think he's off and good to go. Hopefully, he doesn't backstab me. That would suck. But uh, for what it looks like, I think he's off. He's going to be safe. He's not going to have issues with zombies or hopefully he doesn't run into bandits. But if he's a good player, he can do it, guys. Um, if he wants to tag along, sometimes people do that. So if we're in a lucky situation where he's nearby, we can actually work with him. I see him down there. He's just chilling. Looks like he's... Uh, I think he's looking for me, if anything. Uh, yeah, this is me, dude. Don't kill me. <laughs> okay, what's up, dude? What's up, dude? All right. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's take out some of these walkers. So this is actually a really awesome area. If you guys don't know, this was the last episode of Fear the Crafting Dead was here. Um, or actually, it might be. Yeah, it was here. So the last next episode of the last season finale. What the heck? There's a zombie in the ground. Okay, that, that was really weird. Uh, so Fear the Crafting Dead will have a season finale, and then season two will come around. Oh, gosh. Wait, wait, wait. Shout, dude. Where'd he go? Did he uh log out? No, he didn't. There's no way he did. We gotta take him out, guys. I that that was the plan. So let's see. Does he have Oh yes, he has gear. Okay, sweet. Uh we got some food. Not bad, not bad. Tactical ghillie, we don't need that, but um Anything else in here, we're pretty much set. So as of right now, we have one player kill, 11 zombie kills. Uh, not too bad. Now, if you guys are going to be questioning why I just killed that guy, was one thing for sure is, um, you know, we have someone that's teaming with us. The rest is I want to try and see how many kills I can do and how well I can do with this uh, kit that I made for myself. There are a lot of walkers in here, but it's okay. We can take them out. Uh, this guy's still around. We gotta watch our perimeter for sure, guys. But I think we're okay. So, in in the future, maybe I'll be more safe. This guy didn't look too dangerous. Of course, he was kind of hiding in the corner. But, oh. What was that? Did I? I, hear, I heard something. We're gonna get our trench gun out here. We're gonna slowly go down and see if there's anyone nearby. I don't think... Oh, there, is that zombie? That's a zombie over there. Okay, it's Walker. Anyone down there? No. Okay, we're good. Let's keep looking around see if we can find some more supplies. Um, that's not half bad. Oh gosh, there's more of you guys in here. There's a lot of walkers, um, in this port, so we gotta watch out. But there's a lot of supplies, which is always a great thing. Uh, we don't need that there. Uh, there should be some gear upstairs, uh, besides walkers, of course. Uh, oh yes, a wrench. A wrench is pretty good, actually. It's another handy melee weapon, just in case we have issues here. 
Um, okay, that looks fine. Okay, sweet. Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think about this. This one, I think, is personally a bit better, this design, because it has more armor. But it also kind of looks good. So, I'm kind of happy. Oh, I think it was this guy who was making that noise. Yeah, I think it was. Okay, so we're, we're fine. We're, I think we're in the clear here. We can store that in there. Trench gun, we can store it in our side on the back. All right, perfect. Let's keep looking around. Maybe we can find some more people. If I, Oh, that's him. Okay, he has a pistol. <laughs> I have to always make sure this guy... Can be a bit sketchy. Oh, yes, an empty syringe. Um, that could be good if we find a cure by any by any chance. So, we're in good shape right now. I think we can actually get out of this uh, port because we kind of been uh, looking around for a bit. Oh, gosh. Okay, I just killed him. Wasted some ammo. All right, we got to get out of here. I think we caused too much attention. Um, which way would be a good way to go? Oh, I have a perfect area to check out. Uh, I kind of know this map a bit more now. So, if we go down this road and take a left, we should encounter a... Um, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, it is a... High, uh, uh, t uh, t um, what's it called? A bridge. And uh, across that bridge, there should be a mansion nearby. All right, I don't see any people around here. So, I'm going to reload my gun. FNFAL. Because this thing needs to have... Ah, we can't load all the ammo that's kind of sucks six bullets i guess can help me out actually what i want to do for safety is i always want to have my trench gun out here because this thing will destroy anyone in its way so i think we're going to stick with a trench gun just for emergencies uh because i tried this thing out before it is really really strong it's, it's a dangerous gun um so what i'm going to do is actually we'll keep walking around here we got a good amount of action uh hopefully across this bridge we can find something i'm pretty sure if we go down what was that whoa Wait, is this guy... Oh, he's not. Oh, there we go. Trench gun in action. Oh, there we go. Trench gun in action, boys. There we go. This is what I'm talking about here. Okay. Oh, sweet. Wait, we got to watch our back. We got to watch our back. Reload. Always reload, guys. Always watch your back. Because that... Something bad can happen where he just shows up again somehow, luckily, and just takes me out with a really simple gun. Okay, we got to get this gear. Um, No, we don't need that ghillie suit. We could take the helmets, those are cool. Okay, we got some flammable gear. A lot of stuff in his backpack. I hear something. Oh, oh gosh, there's a lot of zombies. Okay, luckily we did not get destroyed. I see another guy down there. Um, is that who I think it is? There we go. Nice, sweet. I think we're on a roll right now. We already have three ki player kills, and that was kind of my goal at the end of the day, so we kind of did well. I don't think he has supplies, but that guy had plenty more. But, uh, all of a sudden, like, everything just happened all at once. That's crazy. Uh, we can actually probably use our med pack, if anything. And then we gotta find some shelter, because, uh, the walkers are kind of, uh, finding themselves a tasty meal if I keep standing around. So, let's just med pack up. Uh, let's collect some of this gear. Don't tell me it disappeared. Okay, it's still here. Um, what else can we get? Water canteen. Bolt cutters we don't need. Other than that, uh, we can get rid of the body. Perfect, so no one else gets the loot. Drink up some water and take out these zombies and walkers. Uh, keep calling them zombies and walk. I don't know why, whatever. Uh, I feel like there could be a small town down the road. Uh, I know that across the bridge there's a lot of stuff down there. So, uh, just for safety, I think we're going to see if we can find a small town around here that we can just hold off for the night. Uh, if not, we can probably just pull into the woods um, and hold off there for the, a few days. And then into the next episode, we'll just uh, move on from this spot or wherever we hold off. And it should be pretty good. Maybe we'll meet up with Bearzilla or Matrix or Donnie or even... Um, anyone else really so if you guys have anyone else i should collab with let me know in the comment sections uh but this is actually pretty cool this is like on the edge of the mountain so i actually personally don't think i've ever uh went on this side of the map before so that means there's gonna be a lot of things to explore in the next episode so i'm pretty happy with that i think it's pretty cool and we're coming near the 15 and 15 minute mark which is kind of towards the end of the, every episode i usually try to go for 15 minutes so if you guys haven't already left a comment or hit that like button um you know if you liked what you saw then make sure you guys hit that like button and look at this we found a perfect little village to hold off for the day like that's what i'm talking about we're gonna do slash near just for safety here there's no one around here that's perfect so again if you guys have it make sure you guys hit that like button it does show me a lot of support i also leave a comment down below about what you think about today's episode um and i will make sure to do my best to check them out and see what you guys think what is this oh another bravo loot crate i thought you can't get those uh, i guess i'm wrong now uh i think it was a business suit we don't need a business suit um other than that this guy had a lot of stuff in here let's check it out uh, he had some basic gear, actually. It wasn't something crazy. However, he does have some good magazines in here. Um, so that's not too bad. So we'll take that back to home base. Eventually, we got some rope. We can always use that. 
Um, and let's check the upstairs, hold off here for a few days, another piece of rope. So that's awesome. So guys, if you enjoyed, my name is Alexson. Peace out and stay foxy.